Hello. I thought that because the digraphs are always something that people find a little bit tricky and when people are beginning to read, sometimes we forget to put the two sounds together to make the new sound, to make the digraph. But we'll do some revision of some of the trickier sounds. So, mirror. We're learning the sound sh. To be successful, I can say the sound, I can do the action, I can recognise the sound in word, I can hear the sounds in words and I can begin to blend the sound with other sounds to read words. Okay, let's have a look at this. This looks familiar. This is something that we do in school. So we'll begin by listening to the story. I want you to listen to see if you can hear the sh sound. Maybe every time you do hear the sh sound, you could do the action. Mrs. Shaw has just had a baby. The baby is called Shannon. Sam is her elder brother. He thinks she is all right, but she cries a lot. While his mother tries to get Shannon to sleep, Sam goes and plays with his toys. He plays in his shop with his cash register. It makes a very loud ting when the cash drawer opens. Shh whispers Mrs. Shaw, putting her finger to her lips. Shannon is nearly asleep. Let's go downstairs for a while. Okay, says Sam, adding shh as they tiptoe quietly from the room. You see some things in the picture that might have the shh sound. Can you see the Sh eep. Sh eep. Can you see the sh eep? Maybe you saw the sh ip. Sh ip. Ship. Can you see the sh ooze? Sh ooze. Shoes. Oh, there's a big sh arc. Sh arc. Big shark. I hope you spotted those sh words. You can maybe see some other things in there. Here's how we join this and the hip. This is a tricky join. When you're writing it, you can just write them close together. So, start at the top goes round, all the way round, back on itself, up to the top, down, halfway up on the same line, round and flip. Can you try that? It goes round, back round, all the way up, down, back up, round, down and flip. There we go. I'm going to show you so you can go right, oh, it's not going to work. Let's click on the pen here. And do it blue. We go round, back on itself, on the same line. Then we're going back up to the top, ready to start. We go down on the same line, back up, round, and click. But you can do it just like this, a normal, oh, normal and then the hit is a taller letter it's an ascender it goes down round and flick when you see them together you say shh it's one sound it's one sound shh let's have a look here it sounds that do you remember that sound what sounds that At that one. That one is. Let's do some blending. Let's see if you can sound out these words. Bitter ash. Bitter ash. Burr ash. Brush. What about this one? Flash. 
This is a blend at the beginning. Flash. Flash. Sh at. Sh at. Shut. Sh -ock. Sh -ock. Shock. Can you try these ones yourself? This one. What do you think it is? Can you try this one? The diagraphs at the beginning. We've got sh, or, sh, or, t, sh, or, t. About this one. With Maybe you can think of some of your own shh words. Maybe mums and dads or big brothers or sisters could give you some simple shh words to try and write down. They could say the word, they could dictate the word, and you could try and write it down. Or maybe give mums and dads a list of shh words that you can try and spell. Okay, until next time. Bye.